Hi, I'm Mick LaSalle, and welcome to The Beauty of the Real. You're about to see a movie called Les Ambitieux from 2007, and it stars Karen Viard. Karen Viard is really remarkable. Now, of course, I've said this about just about everybody in this festival. Everybody in this festival is remarkable, uh, or else they wouldn't be in the festival. But Karen Viard is, is sort of in her own special category. Uh, earlier in the week, I referred to her, if you were here, why well, I referred to her whether you were here or not, but if you you heard me, if you were here, uh, I referred to her as the Meryl Streep of France. And what makes her the Meryl Streep of France is not just that she's really good, because like I said, they're all really, really good. It's not that she's so enormously talented, but it's the way she's really talented. You know how it is when you're watching Meryl Streep that you never forget you're watching Meryl Streep? Uh, she could be playing Margaret Thatcher, she could be playing uh, the woman in the Devil Wears Prada, she could have the, you know, the dingo could have eaten her baby, anything. But it's always Meryl Streep, you're always aware it's her. She can have an Italian accent, but it's always Meryl Streep. And part of the fun of it is noticing Meryl Streep within the roles, even as you believe what she's doing. And it even goes beyond that, part of the fun of watching Meryl Streep is enjoying Meryl Streep be Meryl Streep. It's enjoying her enjoyment of her own talent. Well, that quality is very much a quality of Karen Viard. She she is enormously, incredibly talented. It seems to come very easily to her, and yet, and, and at the same time, it's always her. And uh, now, in this film, she plays um, sort of an obnoxious book editor. It's a role more like uh, the way Karen Viard is perceived in France. It, it's more of a typical kind of Karen Viard role. Karen Viard usually plays women who are very unaware of what they're doing. That is, like they have, they're not, they don't know how they're going over. They see themselves one way, but they're really another way. And uh, that, that could be said uh, for the woman in this film. Another thing that she does, and I want you to pay attention to that. By the way, if this starts shaking, it's because, well, well I'll tell you after it happens. This might not start shaking. Sandrine, come here. Come here. Have some cat treats. I have right now, I have, um, I have the camera. It's not on a tripod. It's on a cat tree. And the cat is about to, yeah, there you go. All right, it's party time. The cat is about to jump on it and shake everything up. What was I saying? I was saying, uh, in this film, uh, she plays this. Blah, blah, blah. Oh, yeah, one of the things that she does, one of the things that's characteristic of her. This movie is essentially a comedy. But as Karen Viard says, when she plays comedy, she likes to bring it into the realm of drama. And when she plays drama, she likes to find the ridiculousness of it. She, always with her characters... Are, it, it, always with her characters, what she's doing is just bringing them into this, just a, a touch of the absurd or a touch of the, the real in the midst of comedy. She is, and she says, that's why you can always tell it's her, perhaps. Anyway, you're about to have a real treat because you're going to have a, a very uh, singular encounter with a kind of a maximum strength dosage of an amazing, amazing actress. Look for the scene when she opens the box. Just look for the scene when she opens the box. That, 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 I'm not going to say anything more. Anyway, Les Abishu 2007. Enjoy it.